Hey guys, in this video we're going to quickly learn how to create a stream notification completely from scratch using this editor. Before we get started though, the most important thing to note is that the link that you're going to put in your OBS or XSplit software is located up here. By default, this link encompasses all notification types like follow, tips, treats, hosts, all that stuff. So let's say for example you want to have a link that's for treats only, right? So what you have to do is you have to click on separate links up here then uncheck everything that isn't treat so you're going to uncheck all this except for treat make sure that one is checked then the link here is a link you're going to put in for obs and that link will be for treats only so with that out of the way i'm going to get rid of everything you see here so we can build a notification from scratch so let me go ahead and do that Okay, so since this notification is for tips, the first thing we're going to want to do is add some text. And we're going to make this text basically say the name of the person who sent you a tip. So to do that, first let's get rid of this filler inside of here. And once you do that, you click on insert tag over here. We're going to select viewer name. And that's pretty much it. If you want to edit this in any way, you can hover over it and click on the, the green pencil. And you can change all its properties here, like you know the, the font size, font itself, the color, all that stuff. So one important detail to mention is this. If you want the viewer's name to appear directly in the center over here, uh, in the notification one thing to consider is that viewer names you cannot detect or predict how long they're going to be like their name could be Bob or their name could be hey my name is Bob you know it could be very long or very short so what you do is you click snap center and what it does is it makes sure that the name will always appear directly in the center so the next thing we're going to add here is an image we do that by clicking right over here and you can choose to either upload your own or you can just use one from the gallery. In this example, we're going to use the gallery one. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, pick this dog over here. And as you can see, this is obviously way too big, right? So to resize it, you simply drag from the top right. You can just drag down or up and it'll keep the scale and size perfectly fine. We're going to resize it down to this size. And we're also going to snap this to center so that it will be properly aligned below the viewer name. The next thing I'm going to add is the text that explains what the viewer did. So it'll say something like viewer name has sent the tip for X amount of dollars, right? So I'm going to go ahead and move this up a bit and I'm going to add a brand new text element. And in here I'm going to type has sent a tip. And once again, I'm going to click insert tag, except this time I'm going to select amount tipped. So for this, I don't want to keep it blue. I kind of want to make it more exciting. So I'm going to go ahead and change that to uh, light green like that. And just for the sake of accuracy, I'm going to hit snap center. And finally, we're going to add the viewers message. We get rid of this text here, insert tag, viewer's message. I'm going to go ahead and make this a bit smaller, make it white, and also snap this to center. And finally, we're going to add the sound. I'm going to go ahead and remove this one so I can show you how it's done. We're going to click add sound, and just like images, you can add your own or you can get one from the gallery. Uh, to preview a sound, you click on the play button. That's how that one sounds like. So we're going to go ahead and use that one. That's pretty much it. We're going to go ahead and save this notification by clicking the save button over here. So the only thing left right now is to go ahead and put this link in OBS and test it.
in OBS, you right click under sources, go to add and you click on browser source. Then you just put in the, the link right here. Move it where you want and we're gonna go ahead and test it now. Hit send test and it should pop up here shortly. Thank <laughs> you.